Hello everybody! Welcome to another Valheim video. Today we're going to learn about lighting. Believe it or not, the sun in Valheim acts just like the sun in real life. And if you want your building to look good from the front, you need to understand where you're placing it. If you face north, well, unfortunately, this is what you're going to get. You're going to get shadows all the time. Whereas if your building is facing south, it will be in the sun, no matter what time of day it is. If the Let's show the sun pass through the sky so you can see how it changes the lighting. Here it is at night, in the middle of the night. Here's the morning. It's just started to be bright now. And we have the sun coming out full force. Sun still in the sky, but just about to set. The sun's setting now. And back to nighttime. Now, let's check out that same series, except with a north facing building. Here we are in the middle of the night. And the morning just started. Now it's almost the afternoon. And the afternoon is ending now. And here the sun is setting. And we're back tonight. So as you can see, whether you're north or south facing has a significant impact on the lighting, which can be great because honestly, this castle here felt more compelling to build simply because it looked better lit. And I didn't realize at the time, but there's actually quite a big difference in the lighting of a north facing or a south facing wall. So if you're going to be seeing this surface a lot, you'll notice it more often if that surface is actually a south facing wall, because that's when it'll get the best light and you'll see the most of its features throughout the day. Because obviously when you're out adventuring, you're not always going to get back at the same time. And often you're going to get back when it's dark and you can't really see anything except whatever you lit with torches. Thanks for watching this video, everybody. If you want to support my work, then consider purchasing a dedicated server from Zap. It's a great way to play Valheim with your friends because they can build stuff while you're out doing other things. Also, comment below if you have something you'd like a tutorial about. I love making Valheim tutorials and I have a whole series of uh, tutorials about like different kinds of bases uh, I've actually been working on. That's actually what this is all part of. But it's been taking me ages because this is just one of like 12 different bases I need to make. And uh, there are much more in-depth tutorials. That's why I've been making just little short ones because I'm actually working on this series that's uh, going to be like 10 or 11 different videos from different angles using all of these things that I've built. So stay tuned if you want to see that. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!